Chris, a disappointing result to, to start 2016. Yeah, well, obviously, yeah, it seems like we've had a bit of a hiding, but it probably wasn't that way, really, in the, in, in the, in the game. You know, we, we probably played quite well. We come here and play well today. Probably the best we've played here for a long time. Um, you know, I thought we felt we were in the game, but we've been just been undone by lacks of concentration. And you can't do that against Tinesco because they're punished here. And, you know, unfortunately for us, the, you know, the first and second goal were avoidable. Um, it's not like they played play around us, you know, it's a, mis a miscontrol on the edge of the box and then we've not stayed with the runner at the back post for the second and third goal and that's, and that's disappointing because they're basics really. And, you know, but I felt in open play, I felt we, we troubled them um, you know, in terms of our, our attacking play and we've created probably more chances than we, we ever have done today but you know, we, they punished us and that's why they're the champions. As you said, you were in the game, you had chances but the timing of the second goal was a bit of a killer by the look of it. Yeah, no, <laughs> you know, it's... Uh, it's crazy, really, because that's what we spoke about half time. Was you know managing the first 15, 20 minutes. We did it superbly well in the first half, um, and you know we didn't we didn't do it well enough second half. And uh, you know they, and now that's why they're the champions. Are going to be the champions again because they they punish teams. You probably get away with it against the teams in the league, but not against TNS. And you know when Neil Mitchell scored that brilliant goal, three one with, with 20 minutes ago, it looked like you might might rally and, and get back into the game, but to concede within 30 seconds, that must be something that you were very disappointed with. Yeah, and that sums up the afternoon, really. You know, we knew what we could cause them problems from, from our set plays and our delivery, and you know, that's the way it was. You know, we scored a goal from it, and they, they didn't really look comfortable defending it all day. But you know, we can't concede goals like that. We've got to do our jobs properly the other end. And you know, I thought for large parts of the game, the players were, were very good and were disciplined and stayed in the shape and a plan. And uh, you know, we tried to hit them on the counter, and we did that a couple of times. But I think, you know, to go 3-1 up and winding ourselves and then concede another one 4-1 four, four one was, uh, was poor from us, really. You're still in the top six. The results are going your way today, so two cup finals coming up now, really. Well, yeah, I think for, you know, for us to be in, to be in, the, um, in the mix, you know, we're the underdogs, we know that every year. Um, you know, we've had to deal with a lot of injuries this year. You know, again, you know, Kieran Mills Evans was pulled out this morning, so we've had to reshuffle the team again from last week. Uh, so we, it's difficult to get consistency, but that tells you all about what we've got and you know, our dressing room self-belief and, and confidence. And you know, to be in the mix with two games to go is fantastic achievement and the players deserve a lot of credit for that.